Good morning, this is Dave. Welcome back to the Smithy Shop. Today we're going to touch on setting the proper cutting height for your lathe bit. This is a very important step to get that nice precision cut that you're looking for. Hey, I've got the mill head swung out of the way, the chuck guard back out of the way, and we're starting off with the four position tool post. This is the standard tool post on the Granite Classic and the Granite MX series. Now, here is an easy way to tell if you're on center line. Keep a little six inch rule like this around, put it in here. Let's just bring our cutter up until it sandwiches that right between the metal and the cutter. Now, if I look at it from the end here, you can see that that ruler's on a little bit of a slant. It's tilted this way. That means that cutter is too low. We're gonna have to raise it up. Here's how we do that. We're going to use some shims. Now, there's a lot of different things you can use for shims. You can go out and buy special shims. Uh, you can salvage shims. That banding that come on your smithing machine is great shims. Let's just see if this is the right size today. Let's put a piece in there. We'll snug this down just a little bit. Let's check it again. Bring this into here. Now when we look at it from the end, it is perfect. That ruler is straight up and down now. We're on exact center line for that cutter, exactly where it should be. Here's a little extra tip for you. Shims for your tool post or anything else that you need. Get you a cheap set of feeler gauges. Take them apart, you got every size imaginable stainless steel shim right there at your disposal. Keep a couple sets in your toolbox. Now let's take a look at the quick change tool post. This is standard on the Granite IMAX and Elite series. You can see I've got a cutter already mounted in one of the holders here. We'll just drop this down onto here like this. And it's locked into place. Now we'll see where we're at. Let's bring this in a little bit and whoa, we're way low on that. Okay, here's the beauty of the quick change tool post. You can adjust the height right here with this nut. I've raised it up just a little bit. Let's check it again. Mm, not quite. Just a little bit more. So unlock it. Screw that nut down a little bit. Lock it. And check it again. There it is. Perfect. So now what you can do is tighten this down with a wrench. And then when you take this loose, you can come back later, put it back on, and it's at the exact same perfect height. This is a nice add-on for your machine. Okay, now let's go ahead and turn this on, and we'll make a little cut here, okay? Set our guard down, we're gonna speed up a little bit. Everything's already set here. Let's come in and see what kind of cut we get. Oh my, look at that. Now that is one beautiful cut. When you take the time to get everything adjusted and set just right, your machine's going to perform exactly the way it should. Hey, now that we've got our tool post set, our tool height set, we can get a nice beautiful cut. So I want to thank you for coming into our shop and watch for our next video.